know what this 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 team has been built upon the culture, and the culture started uh, when I was a freshman, and that was Ada Hutchinson, Josh Ross implemented what this team is all about. And in my sophomore year, it was the exact same thing. Junior year, exact same thing. Senior year for me, the exact same thing. So nothing's going to change for this program. Nothing's going to change for the culture of this team. You know, yes, there's different guys, but these different guys are going to have to be able to understand what it's all about to be a Michigan man and a Michigan Wolverine. So. Um, as long as the camaraderie is high with us, as long as the team chemistry is there, then the sky's the limit for us. And, you know, I'm excited to have uh, new guys. I'm excited to see different faces emerge, like Samaj Morgan. I'm excited to see Timo. I'm excited to see, you know, who, who the quarterback is going to be for us because they're all going to excel because they all have embraced what it is to be a Michigan man and a Michigan Wolverine. So uh, that's why we've been flying around, man. There's, Nothing has changed, you know. Coach Moore has continued to lay the ground rules, the foundation, and the leaders have continued to lead. You know, we call player-led meetings, we call uh, player-led team meetings. You know, and you know when, when something, something isn't clicking, look, there's a leader that's saying, "Yo, like we gotta go." You know, if somebody's gonna say, "Like let's pick it up," or if somebody's gonna say, "We're doing great, good job." You know, it's the positive reinforcement as well as the negative reinforcement that's being balanced in. Um, that all started in 2021 with uh, the prior leaders before us, and we're just continuing to uphold that. I'm great that everything has happened for me because all it's going to do is just continue to push me as a player and as a man. You know, I can't sit up here and say that I haven't faced adversity because I have, but that adversity has made me a man, and that adversity is going to make me a, a better football player. So, like, I'm still confident. You know, don't mistake my confidence confidence for arrogance, but. I'm confident within myself and my abilities and my capabilities. So, you know, my obligation is just continue to bring everybody else up with me, you know, because as long as we can do that, then we will be successful. You know, the thing that I say here is that it doesn't matter what people outside of Schimbecker Hall say. You know, the people's opinions that matter most is who you are with on a day-to-day -day basis. So, you know, that's and that's my coaches, that's my, my, my players, my teammates, and that's the, my nutritionists. And that's the athletic trainer. So uh, I could care less about what people say or what they think or how they view me, you know. I know who I am at the end of the day. And, you know, unless you know me, then you understand me. But if you don't, why would I care?